starting to rain. So we're almost there, we just made it to Mirror Lake, which is very close to Lake Agnes, but a bit lower. So it's looking very pretty, it has a lot of pollen in the water, but it looks great. We're definitely out of shape, we're way too sweaty for this. This should not be that difficult. But this is just a warm up for uh, Jasper and some more serious hikes. So we're at the top now, we're at Lake Agnes and uh, the rain is picking up some speed here. But it was nice on the way up because we're getting pretty hot and sweaty so that was a nice way to cool down. And over here we have the tea house. And apparently the employees have to walk up here every single day and they have to carry the supplies on their backs. That's the proper lifestyle. The elevation here is 2,135 meters. So it's no nothing. It is of significance. But I think we can do better. We're just walking around the lake to get to the trail that leads up to the peaks and all of a sudden we're walking through snow just like that so This is very slippery Stop to take some photos.
So we made it to our first peak and it's very amazing because we could see like Agnes as we were going up and it got further and further and then we got to the top and now we're so high that we can get walk to the other side of the mountain and we can see Lake Louise down there. It's very rewarding. And we made it to the lookout. This is the big beehive, I believe. Big beehive lookout. I don't know where bees come into play, but... Yeah, we're at 2,270. 2,270 meters. Amazing. So if you want to have cool views like these, just pick the hardest trail you can find and pray you make it. That's all the advice I can give you. This is quite spectacular. So we've just been sitting up here taking a break and the, the weather's been clearing up dramatically over the past 20 minutes. The rain has stopped completely, clouds are disappearing and the sun is still so high up, it's, it's amazing. It's 5.47 p.m. and the sun is right there. That's the benefit of doing this. In June, so you have the longest days, so you can really enjoy your time up here. There's no rush to get down. So we're just gonna check out this viewpoint a bit more before going ahead and checking out the second peak, which is a bit further ahead. You can see all of Lake Louise up here. It's quite stunning. And you can even see Mirror Lake that we walked past on our way up here, down there on the left. So we can tell we really hiked up quite a bit. So we're on our way up to Devil's Thumb, which is the higher peak right here. And uh, things definitely get sketchier as you uh, begin your ascent. We just have to climb a little wall. The trail is uh, not always easy to find. There's snow everywhere. The ground is very uneven, but nothing's too scary yet. So we'll keep going. We're almost at the top. These last 200 meters really take the juice out of you. And it is the pure definition of a scramble. This is definitely something else. Not your everyday hike. But the sights are amazing. I think it's about to get better. This trail is something else.
There we are. There's the peak. A little flag. Devil's Thumb. This trail was definitely made by the devil. <sighs> Recommend. Good.